Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about the brand new Apollo Twin X USB. The Apollo Twin X USB is an update to the already existing Apollo Twin USB Duo. In the Universal Audio lineup, you're going to find products that say USB at the end. What does that mean? Any product that says USB at the end works for Windows only. And on this video, I'm going to be talking about the new features and upgrades to the Apollo Twin X USB. All right, first of all, let's do a quick unboxing with my trusty knife. So inside the box, you get the Apollo Twin X USB, a getting started guide that shows you how to register your product and also download and install the UAD software. And under here, you also have the power supply. This power supply comes included with multiple tips so you can connect it into different type of outlets around the world. Let's put all of this to the side and talk about the new features of the Apollo Twin X USB. So first of all, the Apollo Twin X USB is actually an USB 3 interface, but it comes with a Type-C connector. What does that mean? So it's compatible with Type-A or Type-C connections. So all you need is a Type-C to Type-C connector or a Type-C to Type-A connector to go into your computer. Now let's talk about compatibility. This interface works with Windows 10 or 11 64-bit editions. Processor requirements are Intel Core i-series, Xeon, or AMD processors. And now let's talk about features. So this interface has a dual processor, which means it has two cores inside for processing UAD plugins in real time. It comes with two unison preamps that can model other preamps as well. And it also has an ADAT input for up to eight channels of optical inputs. So as far as the new features of this interface, what we have is upgraded mastering class D to A conversion, same as the Apollo Twin X Thunderbolt. We also have a talkback microphone right under the volume knob that allows you to talk to artists or anyone who you're recording. And we also have an upgraded monitor control section that allows you to choose in between an A set or a B set of monitors. Now this interface also comes included with a nice bundle of plugins called the Heritage Edition. If you want to see more information about this interface, check out the UA website below. And if you have any questions about it, please put them down in the comment section. Thank you for watching and as always, like and subscribe to this channel so you can help me create more content like this. Alright, see you in the next one.